the surface, it's about a middle-aged man having fantasies about a young schoolgirl. Not fulfilling those fantasies, but having those thoughts. And then, after a period of time, meeting that girl in a, in a difficult situation and taking his fantasy and revenge out on her in a sexual manner. It also shows very much how rumour can escalate and someone can be accused of a, of a, of a, of a crime that they, they didn't actually do. This kind of shows the more dark elements. It, you know, in the media it's kind of more portrayed as in ethically, morally wrong. Here you're kind of seeing more the consequences of what happens and the aftermath of, of, of what happens once some, something like this um, is portrayed and shown. So I think in that sense it's quite dark, quite powerful as well, quite murky with a bit of an underbelly. We're going for a very stylized look. Uh, each scene has its own particular color palette, its own style to it that reflects the mood of the scene. So uh, in the brothel, for example, we have a lot of red, a lot of um, pinky, purpley colors that uh, in the brothel room. But up until that point, it's quite dark. It's very low key and uh, white lights. And then as soon as he gets into the brothel room, it's it really punches you in the face with the color. The the brothel scene, the Ross wanted it to represent the second level of hell, which is lust, so we lit it with lots of reds and we originally wanted paintings of Cleopatra and Helen of Troy, because in the Divine Comedy they are in the second level of hell. Oh, and you smoke, you breathe the smoke at his uh, face as well, please. That's all right. Um, can you tilt your head up a little bit? This short story uh, came to me about four years ago. It was written by a friend of mine and uh, I used to have some writing classes with him. I, I saw it from the first draft when it was named Mr. Y and it became the teacher until well, finally I suggested, you know, you call it Syria. It's different in the motivations of the character, it's more darker, it's more of a sexual revenge film. Because this piece is tied into the Divine Comedy. There are references to, to, to that and descending into hell and coming through purgatory and being reborn.